Okay, and so let's talk about polarities again, but this time, instead of it being a behavior or a response to an outside situation that you're going to speak up or you're not going to speak up, how about how you treat yourself? About, on the one hand, treating yourself very nicely, or on the other hand, really not being very nice to yourself. So these polarities also take place in your dreams. For example, one woman recently dreamt about a man that she knew from way in her past who was horribly rude to her, and he represents the part of herself that's not nice to herself. And then another person, the polarity that she created in the dream was the appearance of a woman from more recently in her life who has always been especially nice and respectful. So when things happen to us, it's not just about how we are responding to the outside world, hopefully on a situation by situation basis, but it's also how we're treating ourselves. In other words, if you already know this about yourself, that you could go one way or the other, step back from yourself and look at the situation. Because if you make a decision with awareness like that, you've got all the power. I'm Lainey Dolphin, the Dream Analyst.